building our fort now. Kids, are you guys ready? Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Before we start building the fort, I'm just going to take out the chairs and re rearrange the table. I just take away the chair. Let's put the chair Lord over knows here. That I've tried to. You said I was the only one. No one likes being like this. <laughs> you good. made this mess no, and left me with the yes, pieces. Yes, so right. Now I Sorry. wanna burn all the bridges I'm between us. Yeah. Help me. chairs over there. <laughs> this is our little fort. is not really showing the um, Christmas light or what I put there it's not really showing because it's bright because it's daytime now so I'm going to take it out now I want to burn all the bridges between us Show us into your house. Come here. And go. Do you want to go sit down in your house? Of course I do. I tried to put like Christmas lights for you guys. Yeah. 
it was quite bright today like so nina is going to show us round her house so this is the living room and milan is sitting on the chair okay and this is the bedroom bedroom yeah. looks really pretty this is a plant a plant in the back garden yeah, the toilet is back there. Your toilet is back there? Yeah, and um, that's a garden. Another garden? Yeah. You guys have loads of gardens. Because What's at the back over there? Like a chair? Yeah, that's a seat. Okay. And, and this is a book happen. for us to read. Oh, nice. That was making me happy. <laughs> What's making you happy, Milan? About this. Oh. oh Legos. You like your fort or your Legos? My Nina, guess what I saw on the roof? Can what? you tell us what's on the roof of your house? I can see the sun. Oh, yeah. I can see the sun. That's cool. <laughs> that Let's is go cool. Kill. We got sun. We got sun. We got, got, got sun. What a load. <laughs> I love my unicorn. Your unicorn. Yeah. Good. Oh, it's from the slime. Oh, you've also got slime. Yeah. I've never this? Mm -hmm. So when it's night time, what are you going to do to your house gonna, to close it? We're gonna put this down and close it. Can you do, can you put it down so we can see how you're going to put it down? Okay, so we'll put it down like this. Okay. Then we're gonna sleep inside it. Yeah, you're gonna sleep inside. <laughs> this is such a cool house. Can I come and sit down with of you guys? Of course you can. Okay. So big, I can't even fit in. Even if it's white, <laughs> that's my voice. Oh, this is your, is this your car, Pilar? Mm -hmm. Or Chase's car? Or Marshall's car? That's no. Rocky's car. No, it's for these. This is Red and Rider. They're both like riders. <laughs> They're both riders. <laughs> oh, and then we can stargaze because the roof looks like stars. So you guys can stargaze with yeah. your binoculars. Mm -hmm. I can see loads of stars. Let me try. <laughs> Whoa, I see lots and lots of lots stars. Lots and lots of stars. Yeah. Oh, this is such a cute fort. Yeah. Mm. Whoa, this slime. <laughs> You're playing with slime. Yeah, I love slime. Oh. Let's open that this, up. This slime is pink and glittery. This is so nice. This is so squishy. <laughs> and it doesn't even make it best. Okay, so I'm going to read a story to you guys. Okay. So I'm going to read a story to them. Um, let's see. We just need a short story. Nothing serious. Like a really short story. Should we read Aladdin? Yeah. Okay. Let us read Aladdin. Right. So guys, listen. Once upon a time, there was a boy called Aladdin who lived with his poor widowed mother. One evening, a strange man came to visit them. I am your long lost uncle, Abanaza, he told Aladdin. He was not really Aladdin's uncle, but the wicked man knew of a magic lamp hidden in a cave and he wanted to get his hands on it. The enchanted cave could only be entered by an innocent boy and Abanaza had chosen Aladdin for this job. Abanaza offered Aladdin a precious ring. Do you guys have a ring? Okay, I've got a ring here, okay. Abanaza offered Aladdin a precious ring and gave his mother food so Aladdin agreed to help him. Abanaza took Aladdin to the cave and told him the magic words which would open it. Open sesame, cried Aladdin. The cave opened and it didn't take Aladdin long to find the lamp. But when he tried to leave the cave, he found that he was trapped. Aladdin rubbed his hands together to keep warm. At the same time, he rubbed the ring Abanaza had given him. There was a puff of smoke, and to his great astonishment, a genie appeared Whoa. before his very eyes, for the ring was magic. 
Wow. That's Magic so ring. Cool. Oh my goodness. What is your wish? Oh, master, asked the genie in a deep, booming voice. Take me home, said Aladdin, who was still clutching the old lamp. When he got home, he polished the lamp and was amazed to see an even more powerful genie appear. With the genie's help, Aladdin became so rich and powerful that he was able to marry a princess. But one day, Ebenezer came to visit the princess. He offered her a shiny new lamp in exchange for the old one. The princess didn't know about the genie who lived in the lamp and so she agreed. Abanazar ran away taking Aladdin's wife with him. Aladdin could not think what to do until he remembered that he still had his old magic ring. Help me rescue my wife and get my lamp back, Aladdin commanded the genie of the ring. The genie and Aladdin rescued the princess and brought back the lamp. Aladdin was so pleased, he was so happy that he granted both the genies their freedom. Abenazar never troubled Aladdin and his wife again and they both lived happily ever after. The, the end. end. <laughs> that was a great story. That was a great story of Aladdin. Did you enjoy it, Milan? I love that story. <laughs> Maybe we could have story times in here. Yeah. This will be such a great tent for stories, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can sleep in it. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> it's going to be awesome. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the story too. This is our little fort. Yeah. For story time. At least the kids will love this. Like, if I have to tell them stories, we could just build our little fort and share stories together. Yeah. Right. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please make sure you like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. I post videos weekly, and I would love for you guys to be part of my viewers. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye. Peace. Peace.